So, hello everyone. I'm Scoob Raptor. Welcome to the first episode of Charlie's World. Let's get started. Charlie was in this cave, but coming out, having a good time. To be very honest, he does have some bruises, but he was trying to climb up, noticing that there was a baby spino pushes him off. Then, decided to sit, but he actually saw some rocks and a saber tooth. Oh gosh, sorry about that. So Casper jumped down, but he fell down in stupidity, because um, I think that was a very stupidity idea. So, he actually decided, he was like, is he going to attack me? But he went to the top, but he couldn't, me and not been able to push it off. So he actually got it off his back, pushing. He was stuck under it. We got out, whipped him, and knocked him. His paw. Then Charlie knew that it was the end of him. The saber tooth wasn't actually hurting him. He was friends with him. So they decided to go back to the cave, friendly. Casper was guarding, but, I mean, sorry, Charlie was guarding. Um, but, but very goodly, having fun was all they needed. Casper, I mean, sorry, Charlie, I don't know why I keep saying that, going to get food. The Spinosaurus came, unwelcoming them. Saber jumped out, decided to bite his arms, and was hitting him in the head. And then he was, he thought he had met his match. And then he hit him away. Went back into the cave. Welcoming. But, hearing noises, deciding to hide back in, like howling sounds. Something fell off the cave with a dire wolf. So, Charlie went out and accidentally almost fell and decided to pet it. Hugged it and it was ready to live with them. Wooly Monmouth is what Charlie always wanted. But he thought he would never ever get one. So, he decided to stay in his cave happily, but hearing noises. Macrohanthosaurus walking on the top of the cave, hearing noises, sniffing, seeing stuff, trying to break in head peeking through. If you guys can see there, you can see it. I don't think you guys can it's kind of on the, on the side. Yeah, I can kind of see his face. But they decided that they should probably move now since that they have a predator knowing that they're there. But he accidentally hit and knocked himself out. So, Charlie went out real quick and got the rocks. And then he put the other one, jumped over, 
pulled it up and then he fell down. So let's put it up. Now their cave was sealed. But Acro back. He knew where they were. And Charlie heard the noise. But he fell down. Charlie would have to fight for his life to do this. But Acro wasn't very smart. Trying to break in. To a cave. So, well, we're gonna end this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye bye!